Hello, CryoDog here. I uh, wanted to share a uh, tip today for iMovie users. So if uh, you've gotten the recent uh, Mavericks update and you've downloaded the new iMovie update, then you've probably run across this issue where um, you're creating a movie and you have a title, a background, and a title um, slide. So you want to change the title, fonts, size, color, you know, any of those uh, attributes. So what you normally would do is go into the adjust, uh, and this is a little different from the previous version, uh, and I'm going to show you a workaround um, to still be able to do your fonts and, and whatnot um, in iMovie. So here's the issue I'm running into. So I've got a slide, and I've got some text. I want to change the font. Um, as you can see, the font thing's not doing anything. And uh, the color option isn't either. So I can try. So this one gives me the font choice, but it doesn't bring up any options for me to change that. So let me. Um, you know what, let me try a different title. Because I don't know for po for sure, 100% positive that this occurs on all titles, but it does occur on the majority, so it's very aggravating, especially if you're trying to, um, trying to put a quick movie out. So, um, okay, this one works for titles. It appears that the, most of the ones I've tried do not work. The ones that I like, uh, I'm not able to um, change the font or the color. And this one, you know, I don't really care for. It's not that great of a, of a title screen, so. Um, but this one seems to be working. Now, I don't know if it's kind of hit or miss. I don't know that it's constant um, or if it's more of a um, inconsistent issue but I have seen in forums where a lot of people are running into this issue where they're having trouble changing the title and the font um, colors size you know whatever for title screens so here's what um, I've, I've started doing uh, as of recent anyway is um, so I just closed out of the new iMovie, iMovie 10. And if you go to your finder um, and go to applications, you can go down to, um, scroll down to the iMovie section and you'll see that there's a, a folder. Well, there was a folder. <laughs> there's a folder called iMovie. Um, 9.09. So this is the old version, the version prior to iMovie 10. So I just put a icon down the launch pad. Yeah, so I'll just go back to using the previous version where it does allow you to change your fonts um, and uh, colors, sizes, and I actually found something out that I didn't know before as well is you can go into the show fonts and there's a it's like a toggle switch you can toggle between this um, control panel font panel or you can go into the system font panel and there's uh, quite a bit more options uh, as far as fonts you can go to a different category uh, I think I went to the font the fun font um, the last video I did and it was pretty neat so uh, this is very interesting so I think I'm going to go back to using the old version of iMovie and uh, just until they get an update for iMovie 10 there are some things in I iMovie 10 that I do like and I would like to continue using uh, but the font issue uh, being able to make changes and adjust the titles is very aggravating and um, so it's <clears throat> it's it's not up to um, what I would what I would consider a usable state because all the title screens would 
appear to be uh, to look the same so it's kind of boring so uh, for me I'm going to go back to using uh, movie 9.09 um, but I just thought I would share this information with you guys so that you too can uh, get past this whole font issue in iMovie 10 and um, maybe not be, uh, be as frustrated as, as I have been um, in making movies Okay, well that is it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching and have a great day.